Welcome to use key order. Now I tell you how to make <coughs> make menu changes. First of all, we log in. Username one, password is one. Log in. Um, for change menus, we see menu. We got menu one, two, three, four, five, and menu six. So we change menu. First of all, we see the on uh, buttons. We got 57 buttons, including this area, which is switchable between number and the buttons. And uh, so we can change in the buttons and in the dishes. Each dishes is changeable, and uh, these buttons, each buttons are changeable. How do we change it? Now we start. Go to menu. main menu and go to menu edit this one menu edit then we change a menu first of all we enter in the numbers to found the dish um, if we want to change number 77 we enter 7 7 then this is number 77 so we click on it on this dish and this dish comes down here is the dish so there's two meal names meal name English meal name Chinese obviously both dish are uh, need to be entered but uh, when you print you only print uh, English, maybe only print uh, Chinese, or you can print uh, both. Now we make a change. Uh, we change this half pound. We put uh, a number half one snatch. Two. So it become half. One slash two half. Then make price change. Maybe change it to eight pound. Then we farm out this button. Button is here. Here is fifty seven button from number one to number fifty seven. Currently it is on bigger feeder button. It's in this category. Button it means category. So price eight pound. If we want to change button to another button, then we unclick this, remove the tick. So this category has removed. So we put it onto another category. For example, a burger or something. We put it on number fifteen. It says uh, maybe this half pound as burger. Oh. Burger and Chinese need to be entered. His both need to be entered. Here's the key part. You can use this P key part. B U R G E R Burger Safe. So I create a button. Button created and then this dish going to put it onto this button. So I click on it, it's going to mark this dish number 77 going to put it on to button 15 as a burger I just created so we change in this menu and I click on save on this right hand side save it's save in this dish on this left hand side on right hand side here is change a button like a cappuccino I put I can click on cappuccino I change it to couple make it short and I remove this cup short and then save it this is a change in this button hot drink I can make it as hot drink make it short here is a change in the button save 
then the button has changed. I can add on a button like a button number two. I add on it. I put a uh, soft, soft drink. Yes, both uh, box need to be entered. Soft drink. Save. And then here's button change. So I let me change another dish for you. Mm, this only talk about change a dish, not a uh, uh, create a dish. I will uh, record another video, especially for create a dish. Um, we go to change number eighty. We enter the number eight zero. So eighty. I click on it. It come down. Then we uh, we can change this button. We move from this uh, bigger filter, put it onto burger. If we want to change the button, so this dish going to put it onto burger. Then I save here, save, so it's in the burger. Let me come, go out to have a look. Cancel and cancel. Then we got a burger here. There's two dishes. I was creating uh, to move to this uh, category. Let me make another changes, uh, like a cold drink. Here's J2O. I put a J2O orange uh, and J2O tango, whatever it is. No, we remember the number, it's number 89. Number 89. Go to menu, go to menu edit. Put a number 89 to search J2O. J2O, we want the two J2Os. One is a uh, uh, J2O orange, I put O J. Price will be same, button will be same to button number 21. So I make change, I save it. Okay, J2O orange. Price will be same. This is how to change the menu. So menu change, menu changes. That's everything. Thanks, name.